Hey guys, welcome back. <laughs> welcome back to my channel. So this is gonna be my graduation vlog, but because I don't know how much footage I'm gonna be able to get on the actual day when we're actually in Colombia getting it done, you know, I'm gonna be filming things I'm doing in preparation for graduation. You know what I mean? So today is Sunday and I'm graduating on Saturday, so like in a week. And I'm gonna be doing some things this week to get ready, like nails, hair, tan, except I don't think I'm actually gonna tan because I've just been feeling cute being porcelain lately. You know what I mean? Today I dyed my roots so that I don't have growing out roots on graduation, so I just look polished and nice. That's why my hair is wet. And then I just did my makeup for literally no reason. I tried a new foundation today. Hold on. This is the one I tried. It's one of the ones Sarah sent me. It is so light. It's like almost too light for me, but I actually like it. I learned that I like paler foundations on my face rather than tanner ones because like my bronzer and blush shows up better and I like that better and this one is even paler than my wet and wild one and I really like it it's jcat skin insurance max coverage silky foundation now the coverage honestly isn't as good as my wet and wild one that one is just so good I I honestly haven't found anything that I like better and it's so cheap like it's my favorite foundation it's the best you should try it well it works for my skin it works really well this one I tried to layer it in some areas and it didn't work that well but I do like the overall finish of it I wanted to try out the new foundations that Sarah got me before graduation in case I wanted to use one on graduation which I'm still undecided on I'm gonna probably try them again this week and see if I can really come up with a makeup look that I wanna do because I don't wanna be like, oh my god, you guys, we're graduating at 9 a.m. I can't, anyway. So my hair, I dyed my roots this morning and if you're curious, I used Wella 4N, which is medium natural brown. I didn't use Ion again because of what happened. If you missed that video, I used the Ion 5N light natural brown and my hair turned black and ever since then I've just been like trying to, I've been washing my hair a lot with clarifying shampoo, trying to lighten it a little bit. I could use color oops, but I don't want to do all that and honestly I don't hate the dark hair actually being like super pale it's kind of a look I don't know like snow white I like it but yeah I used the Wella 4N medium natural brown to do my roots it seems to be blended pretty well I mean it's still wet but yeah we'll see as you may know I'm not good at doing my hair Although I recently have learned to curl it properly, so I might do that, but I kind of want to do like a trial because I haven't curled my hair with this haircut yet. So yeah, I might test that out this week. Also, <laughs> so many updates for you, I know, sorry. I ordered a different dress because I love the one I got, but I just wanted something fancier. This is a once in a lifetime event. I thought I was never going to get to graduate and I just like want to feel like fancy and pretty. So I ordered one that's a little bit more formal. So I'll show you guys when it gets here. Oh, our caps and gowns came too. Very exciting. We tried them on already. We weren't all glammed up though. <laughs> so yeah, I'll keep you updated throughout this week. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for clicking. <laughs> okay, so I just curled my hair to kind of test it out. I don't know how I feel. I don't like it that much. My hair just has like too much volume. I wish it was longer, you know, like, I don't know. And curling it makes it shorter. <sighs> I might just straighten it. I haven't straightened my hair in so long. So long. I don't know. I don't know. I wish I was capable of doing like a nice blowout with like curlers, like a blow dryer or something, but... <laughs> I just have too much hair for that, like, and I'm not good at doing hair stuff, so, mm-mm, mm-mm. So this is my dress. 
It's from Hello Molly again. And when it got here, it was a little bit big, but Anya's mom altered it for me. I'm not wearing this necklace with it, by the way. And then these are the shoes that I got. You've already seen them. It's Friday, and that means tomorrow morning is graduation. It really snuck up on us. My parents are on their way down from Virginia, and then we're gonna drive to Columbia. And right now I am just packing and I'm about to straighten or curl my hair for graduation. I still haven't decided because I'm not doing it tomorrow morning at an ungodly hour when I have to get up. I'm just gonna get up and do my makeup. But yesterday I did my nails and my toenails, but you're not gonna see that because you don't get to see that. Also, this morning I just did like my final draft graduation makeup and I really, really like it. I did use my regular Wet n Wild foundation just because I know that I love it and I know what it's gonna be like, but I did use an e.l.f. concealer, which I usually don't do, a really, really light one. It's lighter than my foundation to like brighten up my under eye area and I really enjoy it. So I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Other than that, my makeup is pretty much the same as always. Oh, I did order a new Freck, the Freck XL, and it came this week, so I'll have plenty of freckles tomorrow morning. Very happy about that. But yeah, now I have to go finish packing and I have to do some other stuff before I leave. We're going to go to Target too because I still need earrings and a clear bag for graduation for the ceremony. I'll see you later. Y'all. Tell you this again today. You, the COVID class of 2020, 
you have selected a great university and a great university selected you. And my concluding observation, we have been very good for each other. Thank you for being here today. Thank you for inviting all of us and your families to share in your celebration. And congratulations for joining the Guild of Certified Intellectuals. Because today, formerly the COVID class of 2020, will become officially college graduates. Isn't that sweet? It isn't it worth waiting for. Thank you. Anya Victoria Carney. Good evening. I am in the hotel. Today was a long day, but it was a good day. Graduation was great. We took so many pictures. It was a great day. I know I already said this. I got this shirt from the bookstore and I'm so excited about it. It's so cute. But yeah, sorry I didn't get that much footage from today. I just was enjoying, you know. Thank you so much for watching. Class of 2020. COVID class of 2020, unite if you're out there. Love you. Please like and subscribe if you want to, no pressure. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.